my name is Brian Doolittle. I'm a senior on the football team at Texas Lutheran University. I'm Cat Dog Willow. I'm a Division III student athlete at the University of Dallas, and I'm a junior on the volleyball team. Hi, my name is Trey Stewart. I'm a Division III football player at Austin College. I chose Division III because I did not want to sacrifice my academics for my athletic life. I knew going to a Division III school that I could study very hard and not have to sacrifice studying for a test to go to practice and that the coaches and the staff would understand my academic needs. Division three, of course, like most people, was, was not my first option. But as I was a high school senior and I wanted to continue my football career, I realized that this was the best option for me uh, as a student and as a football player. Texas Lutheran was really close to hometown for me. It was definitely in between Howard Payne and, uh, and here. I'm from Houston, so I chose this place because it was really close to home. I wanted to stay close to home. My favorite thing about Division Three football is the time commitment that we put in compared to all the other divisions. Uh, we're not on TV as much. We don't get the publicity, but we do put in just as much work as anybody else does. My favorite thing is probably definitely the balance aspect of it with life. I get to have a social life. I get to see my friends, but then I also get to study and play a sport that I love with the same amount of commitment and the same amount of passion, but I get to experience everything else uh, full force, which is really great. As a Division three athlete, I've had a bunch of experiences that I'll remember for a lifetime. The one I remember the most was my junior year, uh, the last game of the season, when we did win uh, senior day for those seniors. It was a great experience, and we uh, beat Trinity 35-7. to seven. My favorite moment as a Division three athlete was definitely the win over Hart and Simmons this year and making it into the NCAA playoffs. My most memorable experience, that's really hard. There are a lot of them, but I really enjoyed the team bus rides, honestly. Most of the time, our team is super, super talented when it comes to singing jokes, but we love to sing, and uh, we always have a great time on the bus rides to and from games. Regardless of whether or not we win or lose, we always come off the bus with a nice big smile, which is always fun. Balancing school and sports is a challenge for, for most student athletes, uh, and Division three is it's no different. You know, academics comes first when it comes to us athletes. And it was a challenge, but uh, through help of my teammates, help from my coaches, we did whatever we needed to do to say excel in both. Well, it's definitely uh, wake up, do football, go to class, uh, go to more football practice, and any free time I have is I have my face in a book. My career plan after college is probably going to entail more schooling. I'm going to try to go straight into a master's program, which is a uh, luckily provided for at the University of Dallas. They have a good four plus one program and I want to take advantage of that. And probably end up coaching volleyball while doing that, also trying to find some job maybe in the corporate world, hopefully in fundraising. We'll see where my schooling will take me after I graduate. Uh, and really University of Dallas and playing a sport has really prepared me for that because I'm able to take the leadership skills that I've gained and playing the sport and leading the team into my work life, which really makes me stand out as an applicant, hopefully, and then also help me do better in school, which is what I need to do to further my career. I am a kinesiology major in exercise science, and I'm looking forward to being a PT or PTA. I would say since uh, D3 is revolved around school and academics, I would definitely say having priorities straight with my grades and my studies. When I begin my career, I want to be a uh, college football coach. And nothing helps become a college football coach more than playing college football. So I'm hoping to be able to start learning from my coaches here and see where my career takes me.